before trash gets dumped in the garbage machine at the Gore Komhos Utility Center in Russia. The items inside each bag get checked for metal. This ensures there won't be any issues when the garbage gets crushed inside the machine. However, on December 21st of 2020, a center employee by the name of Mikhail Tukash discovered something still living inside of one of the garbage bags. If Tukash hadn't glanced at a seemingly lifeless pile of trash, it would have gotten crushed with the rest of the many piles of garbage that were brought to his work site every day. And if it wasn't for his quick thinking and swift action, his employers might have had a very different story to tell. Trash collectors around the world know that at most times, they have a pretty thankless job. Not only are they dealing with the waste items of strangers, but they also have to make sure that nothing else gets into the trash that shouldn't, which might be harder than it sounds. If you've ever encountered a trash collector, you'll know that they have to stop at dozens, if not hundreds, of houses each day to collect a week's worth of garbage. To do so, the trash collectors simply don't have time to check each and every bag to make sure there's nothing strange lurking inside. Most people throw away food waste and unwanted items around the house, but every once in a while, trash collectors will find something truly weird, like an object that has never been used or a family keepsake that could have been taken to a thrift store. But what one Russian trash collector found pretty much broke his heart. When Mikhail Tukash started working sorting trash on a snowy day in December, he didn't expect the day to be any different from any other workday. His job is to sort trash that has already been collected to make sure that items are about to be crushed won't hurt the company's machinery. When Tukash was working, he swore that the bag of trash headed towards him was moving, but he wasn't about to let something spook him while he was working, so he approached the situation more rationally. But when he lifted up the bag to check its contents, his heart sunk to his stomach when he realized that there was something moving inside. Most people would think their job stinks, but Mikhail Tukash's job was literally a total stinker. That's because he didn't work in the pristine-looking offices of a startup or sit behind a desk from 9 to 5. Tukash walked into the Gorkham Hose Utility Center at the Zavolsky District in Russia on December 21st of 2020, just like he had every other workday since he started this job. But he had no idea that something about this day was going to turn out completely different. Most people don't realize that trash management is more than just collecting garbage cans and sending them to a landfill to decompose. Before the trash gets to its final destination, it must undergo a process that Tukash knows all too well. First, the garbage truck brings the garbage that's been collected around the city to the utility center. Then, the employees cut the bags and throw out all the garbage into a conveyor belt. And that's when the nasty part of the job begins. Tukash and the other employees have to sift through the stinky contents to ensure that there is nothing metallic inside the bags. If they find anything, they remove it before sending it to a garbage machine. But there was something about one garbage can in particular that was very unusual. Generally, the workers have no idea what they're going to find when they rip open a garbage bag. The only thing they know for sure is that they're stinky, which is why they prefer to wear masks when doing this part of the job. But one thing Tukash never considered he'd be doing at work that day was rescuing a life. As the conveyor belt brought in a new batch of garbage, Tukash and his fellow workers got to work right away. But when he picked up one white garbage bag, he had no idea that there was something lurking inside. It hadn't moved, it hadn't made a sound, so Tukash didn't realize that there was a living, breathing thing inside the latest bag he grabbed. But when he cut the bag open, everyone turned and looked to see what had come out of Tukash's bag. Tukash and his fellow workers were in a state of shock because inside one of the bags was a cat. Had he used one of his nine lives to survive? Probably not, but he got pretty close to losing one when Tukash cut the bag open. Fortunately, the feline wasn't hurt, but how did he get inside of the garbage bag? It was a gorgeous cat with black and white fur. The workers were so surprised by the discovery that they stopped the belt line and took a moment to reflect on what they had just discovered. I felt something soft inside the bag, Tukash explained to the tabloid, Moskovsky, Komsolets. I cut open the bag slightly and I saw eyes looking at me. Once the initial shock had passed, he felt like he wanted to cry. Why would someone do this to a cat? He thought to himself. Since the employees knew that they were being filmed by the company's cameras, one of Tukash's co-workers pointed at him and the newfound cat that had popped into all of their lives. But was the little creature okay after its journey to the waste management site? 
there didn't seem to be any signs of injuries on the cat and there weren't any indications that he was malnourished. This confused the workers a great deal. Healthy, happy cats that have good homes don't often jump into garbage bags. So what was this cat's deal anyway? Tukash and the other workers didn't want to leave anything to chance, so they took the cat to a veterinarian to get it checked out. And what they discovered there confirmed what they already knew. This kitty was one lucky son of a gun. But how he got in the bag was no accident. The more and more they thought about it, the more Tukash and his co-workers realized that someone had tossed a healthy cat inside a garbage bag and then dumped it. But would they be able to find the person responsible? There are no words to describe anyone who would toss a living animal in a garbage like this, and as far as Tukash was concerned, this was a symptom of a growing number of people who are nothing more than garbage themselves. But who did this, and why? Finding the cat's original owner was going to be impossible. It wasn't like he had a collar with his human's personal information on it. Regardless of who the guilty party was, it seemed like this person was heartless. But at least the cat was safe now, and he was destined to become a VIP around the world. The original owners might have forgotten about their cat, but the workers at Gorkomhoz and the officials of the Ulinovsk region did not. They considered the feline to be a Christmas miracle, as they found him days before the holiday. But that's not all the praise that this lucky cat would receive. The cat was given the prestigious honor of becoming the Deputy Minister of the Animal Protection Department by the nature of Cyclical Economy Ministry of Yulinovsk region. But would his new role come with a name for this anonymous feline? The cat was a deputy minister without a name, and as of this post, it still doesn't have one, but they plan on throwing a cat naming contest in the near future. The ministry also hasn't revealed what his duties are going to be either, but it's safe to bet that one of the responsibilities included staying cute. And he's not the only one in this situation who got praised. Tukash was the one who found the cat, so obviously he was given recognition for saving the feline. His reward was an added bonus to his pay, which undoubtedly came in handy because of the holiday season. Meanwhile, the cat quickly earned celebrity status. Footage of the cat's miraculous rescue was aired on television news outlets and on social media. This quickly turned the cat into a local celebrity as hearts melted over the adorable creature, who nearly met his demise in the cruelest way possible. The cat was on the brink of death, explained the ministry on Wednesday, December 23, 2020. A little longer and it would have ended up in a trash separator, they added. But this wasn't an isolated incident. This was not the first time that a pet was rescued from the clutches of a trash separator. According to Moscow's local television, there have been others, including an African hedgehog named Vezunka, which is Russian for lucky. Gulnara Rakhmudalina, the environment minister, had this to say to the people of her country. I want to appeal to the pet owners. Remember that you are responsible for those you have tamed. If you can't keep your pet at home, you can always leave it in good hands or at a shelter. Cats sometimes find their ways into strange places like laundry hampers and cardboard boxes, but not many cats find themselves in a closed trash bin with no way to escape. But that's exactly what happened to one unfortunate kitten who did not get there by accident.